Hi everyone, what I have here today is the Mini Wi-Fi Spy camera. Um, if you purchase the Mini Wi-Fi Spy camera, it comes with a package, you know, with the box, and included in the box itself, there's a camera, right? So in the box itself, you see there's a camera, um, the keychain, and as well as a manual and battery, right? It's a manual, and this is a battery, uh, it's a CR2 battery. This camera actually is being powered by a CR2 battery, or you can purchase the optional uh, power pack for uh, 24 hours recording, which I will show you later on. And then there's also this little keychain that you can hook the camera to, so you can hook the camera and carry it around. Now let's take a closer look at this camera. So the camera is powered by battery, or you can choose purchase the optional power pack. I'm going to put the battery inside, the CR2 battery. Right? Close the cover. Right? And then there's the, 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 setting, the switch settings here, right? So there's this off, on, and settings. Uh, the spanner sign here is actually setting, settings. So when you first power on the camera, you know, you will set it to the spanner sign to, to configure it. And after configuration, uh, there's a one-time configuration, you can switch it to the off-on. Normally you can use it between off and on position. This is for configuration. So if I'm going to switch to on right now, right? You can see there's a little LED at the base. Uh, there's a little LED here, okay, that lights up, right? And to tell you that the camera is uh, is running, right? So this is a lens, put it in here, right? And next to the lens, there's actually a small little hole here, which is the microphone, right? So this camera actually records both uh, video and audio and transmits transmit it wirelessly to your smartphone, right? I'm going to put it off, right? Um, so if you need round the clock recording, you no, know, you want to purchase uh, the optional power pack, right? Take out the battery. I'm going to show you the optional power pack. So if you purchase the optional power pack, this is what is included in the optional power pack. Um, this is the stand for the camera, um, the power adapter. Okay. okay, so these are the items that are included in the optional power pack. So with this optional power pack, it actually allows you to power the camera. It's a stand plus uh, uh, electronic. There's some electronic component inside, and then comes with a USB uh, connector at the back, right? You can see here. So what you do is you can actually push the camera into the, the power pack, uh, into the stand. Okay. Turn this around. Uh, okay. Okay. So in that way, you connect. The camera is able to stand, and then you can actually tilt or turn around, right? And with this, you can power your camera via the USB, the USB connector. Right? And you have several options of powering the camera, either using a car adapter, this is a car cigarette adapter, cigarette lighter adapter, right? Um, it's 12 volt, running on input 12 volt to plug into your car. You can plug it here. So you can mount this camera actually on top of your car dashboard for you know, uh, recording while you're on the move. Right? Or if you're at home, you can use this AC uh, USB adapter. So take note, this is uh, it supports 100 to 240 volt, but it comes with a 2-pin connector. So with this, you can actually power up um, the camera uh, via AC uh, for round-the-clock recording. Right? So if you need round-the-clock recording, uh, you can buy the optional power pack. Right? So you can actually take off the camera, right? it's actually mounted this way. You can take it out easily. And then this is actually tiltable, and then you can turn it as well. Right? So this is the power pack item included in the power pack. It's a stand, two adapter, and a USB cable. Right? Uh, and in the camera, this is this is the optional power pack. Right? And you have to buy it separately. And in the camera package, it actually comes with the camera and the battery cell. Right? So let's next let's take a take a um, little look on how how can you use this camera. Right? There's two way of uh two way of using this camera. Uh, one is for nearby recording. That you want to you know capture the video. Uh, for example, in a, the what's happening next door in the next hotel room. Right? In a nearby room up to 25 meter. So you could have a direct connection between your camera uh, to your uh portable uh, Wi-Fi devices such as iPad, iPhone, or Android phone or laptop. Right? This is direct connection. So you can configure the camera to be a, a access point, a micro access point, and then all these devices can hook up to the camera to view uh, the recording as well as to view the video as well as to record the video. Right? Um, the other one, the, the, the other application scenario is for remote viewing that's for long distance. I think for example, if you are uh, in office and you want to monitor what is happening back at home, right? so what you can do is you can configure this camera uh, to connect to your router, right? and then your router is in turn connected to the internet by a broadband DSL cable. And then in your office, you can actually use your uh, intelligent device like the iPad, uh, the iPhone, Android, or your laptop right, to connect to the internet via the internet and then connect straight through the camera to see what is happening at home uh, or record what is happening at home. Right? Um, the difference between this camera and other IP cameras is it comes with uh, applications developed specifically for this camera. Right? Uh, you can use a normal browser like Google or internet, Google Chrome or Internet Explorer to connect to the camera to view, or you can use specialized apps developed for um, the iPhone, iPad, or the Android. These apps are, has to be purchased separately. It's not included uh, in, in this purchase. Right? So upon purchase, I will give you the link to download the app from the Apple App Store or the Google App Store, uh, and then you can load it, and then you can you know, do recording or view uh, the, the streaming, uh, what is happening at home. Right? But if you choose not to buy the application, you can still use a standard browser. Right. So the standard application makes it much easier to, to view because it's actually tailored to the screen size for the phones, right? So this is a short uh, intro video for the, the Wi-Fi, mini Wi-Fi, spy cam and the optional power pack. Um, I hope this information is useful and I look forward to your purchase. Thank you.